SWOT analysis is a common tool for a company to make strategic planning, but it can also be used at a personal level when you are gonna change your career or launch a business. SWOT stands for strengths, weaknesses, opportunities, and threats. If you do it properly, you are able to leverage your strengths, improve your weaknesses, eliminate threats, and find opportunities for future growth. Let's get a piece of paper and divide it into four quadrants. Try answering the following questions. One, identifying your strengths. What are you good at naturally? What education or training have you received? What type of knowledge or skills have you developed over the years? What are your positive personality traits? Two, identifying your weaknesses. Does any part of your education or training need improvement? In what areas do you know you need improvement? What are your negative habits and personality traits? Three, identifying opportunities. Is your industry growing? Do you have connections? What does the job market look like? Is there a new technology in your industry? Four, identifying threats. Who is your competitors? Is your job and industry changing? What is the biggest external danger to your goals? After answering all these questions, you can analyze the results. Match your strengths with opportunities and take bold actions in those areas. For instance, if your skills and education have a competitive advantage in the field, you are in a much better position to negotiate salary with your boss. Then, match your weaknesses with threats to find the areas you should avoid. For example, you may have found a weakness as a lack of communication skills at your company. And you may also find a threat as your colleague fighting for the same promotion. So, you may choose to avoid competing with the person. You can also use the information to convert weaknesses into strengths. For instance, you may have the weakness of getting anxious if you are unable to meet your deadline. You can break the work into smaller assignments and finish it in a predefined time. You can also convert threats into opportunities. Let's say you work in an industry that experiences a downturn and your salary is gonna stop growing. You may quit your job and go to graduate school. When you get a new degree, you may find better jobs. Once you are done with your SWOT analysis, don't forget to take action and track your progress. Keep working toward your goal. You will get where you want to be.